and followed by Robert Hutchinson. <laughs> For those of you who didn't get that, it's Larry McDaniel. I just want to say, you know, I got to the race late, but the race is not given to the swift, it's given to the one who endures to the end. And I plan to be there at the end for you as a listening commissioner. One of the issues that I have as a commission candidate is the relationship of the current county commission to outlying communities, or communities that are not labeled Gainesville. If you look at it, that relationship has been very contentious. And what we have to do as a commission and what we have to do as people is understand that we have to develop plans and we have to de develop relationships and we can't just come when there's a problem. We have to be there present, ever present to deal with the issues that I, many of our outlying communities have. And that's one of my main issues that I would like to uh, concentrate my time on. Another issue for me is growth. And I think the person who spoke, uh, Commissioner Barley, who spoke before me, we have to manage growth in a smart way. And we have to understand that no growth is probably not the answer, but to manage it in a way that all sides are listened to and a comprehensive, and it falls within the guidelines of the comprehensive plan. Uh, I am for listening to folks. I am for bringing everybody to the table. I am for bringing equal access and opportunity for those things. Um, as he said, the I-75 part of the uh, toll road, all of that stuff is on our plate. And it's how we deal with those things on our plate. Those who are last shall be first, and those who are first shall be last. And at that table, we really need to learn to drink the water and make sure that the water is clean. And I appreciate you for listening to me. I come to you as a 25-year Army veteran. I come to you as 30 years experience with uh, county and state government. And I believe, given the opportunity, I will serve you well, because I will listen. Thank you. Next speaker is 